Hi, it's Elizabeth Merrick, and we're back in the Jarvis AI dashboard, and we're going to be checking out how to actually move different documents and AI outputs to different project folders within Jarvis. Check this out. Hi, we're going to jump into the dashboard in Jarvis in just a moment, and also show how to actually move documents and AI outputs in between different project folders. It's easier than you think. But if you're finding these videos helpful, please go ahead and subscribe to the video. Uh, no, subscribe to the channel, like the videos. That helps us out with YouTube and also helps other people find this information as well. So first off, let's go ahead and go into the dashboard. And right here, um, we're gonna demonstrate here, we're in a project called Test2. And we've got a couple of documents sitting in there right now. And within test two, we're going to select these documents by dragging the mouse or cursor across them. And you'll see they turn kind of a shaded color and we get this menu bar up here that appears. We can move them, delete them or unselect all. We're gonna go ahead and move these and select the folder test. And when we check out the folder test, we'll see they have arrived. There they are. So it's not particularly intuitive right now, but it is very, very easy to move um, the documents and also the AI outputs. Here's a AI output here for content improver. We're going to select these top three. You're going to see the move, delete, unselect all options appear automatically. We're going to select move and we're going to move these over to test two. And when we go to test two, you'll see these AI outputs are now sitting here in test two. So it's that easy to move things back and forth. Now the platform, it's still new. It's still going through some growing pains and whatnot. So I imagine it's gonna be updated and become even easier and more powerful to do good housekeeping practices. And we'll be updating this video as time goes on as well. Um, but stick around you'll see some more really cool stuff <laughs> hey here's something else that i think you might find helpful in terms of good housekeeping and that is how to delete a project file so down here in the left corner where the projects are go ahead and click on that and you'll see your list of projects now if you want to delete a folder a project then you just click on the three dots here and you can see rename or delete go ahead and click delete this is a practice folder that i set up for this purpose be sure you don't delete something accidentally so we'll click delete are you sure because it can't be undone yes and it's deleted now you'll see this folder down here with the green check mark that's the active project folder and if you click on the three dots with that one, you can only rename it. So bear in mind, you can only delete a project if it's not the current green one. So that's all we have on this video. So stick around while we put together some more videos of some tips and tricks to help Jarvis perform for you. Mm -hmm.